Simple science. What is blood? Blood contains three kinds of cells: red blood cells, white blood cells, and platelets, suspended in a fluid called plasma. Red blood cells, also known as corpuscles or erythrocytes, make up about 45% of blood. A single drop of human blood contains millions of red blood cells. The function of these red blood cells is to carry oxygen from the lungs to the tissues of the body. A red blood cell is shaped like a tiny disc with a dent at the center of each side. Red blood cells are packed full of molecules of the red-colored protein hemoglobin, which combines with oxygen to form oxyhemoglobin. Hemoglobin is made up of four polypeptide chains, each of which has a ring-like heme group at its center, containing an iron atom. Oxygen can bond reversibly to these iron atoms to be transported in the blood from the lungs to cells and tissues all around the body. A red blood cell is shaped so it can contain a lot of hemoglobin. While having a great enough surface area to let oxygen diffuse easily in and out across the plasma membrane, red blood cells do not contain either nuclei or mitochondria, leaving more space inside for hemoglobin. Carbon dioxide, produced as a result of cellular respiration, is transported back to the lungs. Dissolved in the plasma as bicarbonate ions. Plasma makes up about 50% of blood. Plasma is a yellowish liquid, 90% of which is simply water, with salts, glucose, vitamins, urea, proteins, and fats dissolved in it. Blood also contains white blood cells or leukocytes. Which help fight infection in the body. Some white blood cells can migrate out of the blood into surrounding tissues to devour bacteria and other foreign bodies. While other white blood cells, called lymphocytes, release antibodies that attack germs. Finally, the blood also contains cells called platelets that help form blood clots. And so stop bleeding. Platelets have irregular-shaped bodies with sticky surfaces. When bleeding from a wound occurs, platelets gather at the wound site. They react with a protein called fibrogen, creating a web of fibrin threads that trap red blood cells in their mesh. As this dries and hardens, it forms a clot. Or scab that plugs the wound and stops the bleeding.